Welcome back, one and all, to Trails of Cold Steel 2. I am the Dark Seraph. Last time. We arrived. Here. In the North Highlands, and we found Gaius. Now we're gonna go look for Milliam and Elisa. You are to the northeast somewhere. Yeah. There's a treasure chest over this direction. Winds, give us your It's my And turn. now it's time to see what Gaius is capable of. Yeah, there. They're oh open. wow. Got you. His attack animation is a lot different from before. Second form. Damn. Now's our chance. Here. I don't think that's a bad thing. I actually quite like his attack animation. It's my turn. Leave it to me. Now, let's take a look at... I don't think I ever used this before. Huh? Take this. They're open. I don't remember Got using you. that. This is it! You're mine! Together, Still just as dodgy as ever. Great! Yeah! Oh, got a level got up. It. Anything new? No. What an ornate treasure chest. A black bangle. Prevents sleep. A bangle made of leather that digs into your wrist. Sure. For some reason Let's I remember going. sleep being an annoying status. Thing even made. <laughs> Can't blame you for being so surprised. It is magnificent. I keep wanting to hit triangle oh, to dismount. Geez. I wonder what's inside. A cool necklace. So it means I can picture Gaius wearing a necklace. Prevents burning. Necklace set with water sepith. Hmm. Sure, let's use that for now. I know you don't see them on perks in in-game, you know, I wish you did. I think that'd be a cool mechanic, but alas, we don't get to see that. I can understand why. And that could also be a lot of conflicts with the Wind. special outfits, so I can understand not having ah! visible accessories, right. which there. only 
Now! Assist you... I'll set you up! Minorly. All right! There! Now! Got you! Okay! Arcus, activate! Try this! Thanks! Here I go! Marcus, activate! All right! There! Huh! All right! Now! Got you! This is it! Okay! Hey! Now! Opening. My turn. Ha! All right. Ah. <laughs> Good work, everyone. What an ornate treasure chest. Move two. I can see that being useful on Gaius. Get going. I can also see it being useful on feed. Is there another chest? There is another chest. Fury of bomb. That's useful. Let's get going. <laughs> Excuse me. From here on out, it's all new territory for me. How does it extend, Gaius? This will actually take you all the way to the Republic. If we keep going straight ahead, you can see the Watchtower to the south as well. That could be a problem for us now that this un it's under the uh, Noble Alliance's control. We'll have to be careful that none of their airship patrols notice us. Now we just have to find Elisa and Milium. That we do! My guess is they're gonna be at the shrine. All the way at the end of this corridor, land, stretch of land thing. Oh my god. Yes. Machius got a level in that, and Fe and Reen die, and Reen fainted. That was annoying, very, very annoying. Enemies ahead! Let's move! Ha! Green! Buddy! Bro! I understand Understood. you're probably a little there. groggy from getting it's my knocked turn. out, but you gotta wake up, buddy. There. Right! Arcus, activate! Try this! Thanks! Let's move! Second form! Damn! Alright! Ah. Thanks! Leave it to me! Let's 
move. Sit. Rain. Open your eyes, buddy. It's my turn. There. Uh, onward. Uh, here's our chance. I'll back you up. You really. Honestly, Rain, you got to get your act together. To me. Onward. Ah. It's my turn. Ha. It's my turn. Let's move. Ha. All right. Ah. Here's our chance. I'll back you up. It's my turn. Ha. Leave it to me. Here I go. Ha! All right, there. Ceasing hostilities. Let's move onward. Let's get going. Great. Green. I've got it. Elliot. What I want Blair to just getting and started. Gaius all got a level up. Now I use my override. Oh, chest. I override, what's excuse me. And let's get going. What is that? Oh my god. Prevents confusion. God, one of those things. Why one of those things? Uncert. I hate these things. It's huge. I've never seen anything like it. They're a pain in the ass. Ugh, there was a beast just like it in the old schoolhouse. Yeah, you have a, probably don't have any more of a pleasant memory than I do. Grandfather, Milliam and I can take care of this. Yeah, this will be a piece of cake. Wow, you, Milliam's voice actor got better. Lemmy! Go, go, go! What? Is it that strong? Ugh, this beast is downright nasty compared to the others around here. <sighs> we are so screwed. Run away, now! Forget about me, just run! Elisa, Milliam! What? Huh? Elisa! Milliam! Are you both alright? We're here to help! Well, if it isn't Gaius, and you're... Green! You're totally alive! No! Oh, no, 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 no! I'm a ghost! And Claire's with you, too? Double score! We can talk later. Our first priority is taking down this beast. I like that million pointed out Claire. Just be careful. This is no ordinary beast. It's a cryptid. A cryptid. Um, those are actually... Uh, Bigfoot's a cryptid, for example, is a good way to put what a cryptid is. They're strange cryptic creatures where sightings are not sure to be trusted or not. And Milliam, I'm going to give 
Fee a hard time about wearing short shorts. I'm gonna give you double A a hard time about wearing short shorts. You are 13. Gotcha. Ready? Oh, oh, Ali oh well, I have Elisa and Milliam in this group. Oh, no, 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 no. Yeah. Burn to ash. Burn to ash. Fall! No I don't like that. Turn to flames. Burn! Elisa, I it's really did not need you to miss. Come on, Nocturne Chime Bell. Nocturne Bell! Did I break the art? No! Damn! That's why you do not let that thing get arts off. Here I go. No, no, no. Art. Earthlands. Activate. Yes, sir. Here goes. I can do this. Huh. Yeah. Okay, Earth is not the way to go. It's my turn. It's time to bring the hammer down! Not letting you get that off. Seventh Rhapsody! You've been a wonderful audience. Gather on my blade. He's getting two attacks. I don't like that. Damn! I did hurt it big I though. Do this. Fire. One more. Punch in his stupid face. Uh, Machias got a level. Exactly how it should be. Whew. Down it goes. Yeah, that should have done it. Oh, thank Adios. But what a monster! 
The one in the old schoolhouse was strong too, but this seems even stronger. You called it a cryptid, didn't you, Celine? Right. Ordinarily, cryptids shouldn't exist on this plane to begin with. But there's something abnormal taking place here in Erebonia, and it's not the war. I can only assume that abnormality having an effect on the land is what caused it to appear. Some abnormality? Are you implying that something else might be happening at the same time as the war? <laughs> Claire! I'm so happy to see you! Aww. Milia. I'm so glad that you're all right. It's wonderful to see you again. <laughs> yeah, same to you. That new outfit you got looks smoking on you, too. <laughs> smoking, huh? <laughs> Rain! Do we really need the whole shtick of we don't know who just said that? <gasps> Neither can I. So, um, have you been doing okay? I'm glad to see you were able to find Gwyn at least. Yeah, I... Wait a minute! Never mind me! What about you? Where have you been ever since we parted back at Trista? And how did you end up coming here? I wound up in your mirror and magic. And I can see how you would be with Celine, but how come you're with the others? Magic. <laughs> It's a long story. It involves magic. I'll fill you in on all the details you want later, but that'll have to do for now. Sorry for being a pain. Oh, enough of that. I should be the one apologizing. I'm so sorry for all we put you through. Huh? What are you sorry for? We knew just how much it would hurt you to part with us like that. We knew our choice would bring you nothing but suffering and misery. We knew that you'd blame yourself for what happened, for not being able to find a better way. Ugh. But that was the only choice we had. At the end of the day, we believed that was the best thing for all of us, and for this country as a whole. Even if it meant willingly forcing all of the burden onto you. I'm so, so sorry, Reen. Please. You've got nothing to apologize for. You're right. You didn't have a choice. There was no other way. But here we are, together again. And it was only because I could trust in all of you that I was able to come this far. I couldn't be more grateful. If anything, I should be thanking you. So, that's exactly what I'm going to say. Thank you, Alisa. <laughs> you big goof. Thank you, Reen. Thank you for coming back to us. And from this point on, I won't be going anywhere without you. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> Always good to see young people living up their youth. I'm surprised you've got no problems with sharing a passionate embrace like that in front of your old grandpa, though. Not that I mind, of course. It was just, I got all emotional seeing him again, and don't go reading anything into it, okay? Sounding mighty suspicious to me. She likes him. <laughs> okay, it's Milliam time! Whoa, hold up. <laughs> you are just right to the point. Oh, I missed you so much, Reen. Wasn't expecting you to be hanging out with Claire, though. <laughs> well, suffice it to say, a lot's happened. I wasn't expecting you to be with Elisa and Gaius either, to be honest. I would have thought you returned to the Intelligence Division. Oh, Reen, that's adorable. You're adorable. You should know me by now. I'm as much a part of Class 7 as the rest of you. And that's why you came for us, right? Because we're classmates? Yeah, you're right. 
Class 7 wouldn't be complete without you, Milliam. I hope we can keep counting on you. <laughs> yep, always and forever. <laughs> We've finally found everyone who's in Nord. And hopefully, we can find the rest of us soon, too. I'm so happy for you all. Allow me to offer my congratulations, too. I'm sure you must have a lot of catching up to do, but I think we should return to the lake for now. I managed to get a look at how things are in the Watchtower. I will go to the shrine, the by watchtower. the way. Lacan did say that you'd gone to investigate something. Lacan. It looked like the damage from the attack earlier this year had been repaired. But are you suggesting it has something to do with the orbital communication problems in the region? It certainly does. It's got this really annoying thingy on it, you see. A jammer? Yeah. Okay. Check something real quick. Upload still going, okay. Yeah, I remember that. Yeah. Well, you can't. How can I put this? The imp the Noble Alliance are a bunch of assholes. Just a minute! Okay.
Ah. I remember that. Elisa Milliam Elisa Reen. No. Uh, Reen Milliam Reen Elisa. Okay, uh, stay. I can now quick travel around here. Next time I'll be going up to the shrine there. But first things first, let's look at your unspeakable. Let's look at your casuals. Again, I really like your casuals, just that. It looks very natural. I think that's just a little too frilly, but it does fit you to a T. Unspeakables. Oh my god. It's a sailor scout. She's a sailor scout. Oh my god. I love that. That is that is amazing right there. <laughs> okay. It's my turn. Right. And she's even in the costume. Yes, sir. Oh, let's look at your casuals. My turn. Again, that's very casual and very adorable. Very casual and very adorable. I don't like the short shorts, but no matter what, you're wearing short shorts. <sighs> well, at least with just that, you're wearing pant. You're wearing something, so you'll have that on. I'm in this one here. Thank you all for watching. Join me next time on Trails of Cold Steel 2 as I go explore the shrine to the northeast. But until then, I am the Dark Seraph, signing off.